So I'm here with Leon Broder, Saturday's 2 1 win against King Langley. What was your thoughts on the game? <laughs> um, just three points. That was the, the main objective before kickoff. Um, wasn't the prettiest game, not going to lie. It was a hard fought, hard fought win at the end of the day. If, uh, pick up the paper tomorrow and um, it wasn't a spectacle, it wasn't a great for non-league, but three points on the table and uh, that's what we needed after Saturday's result. Yeah, and we saw um, Ethan Vaughan, who's on loan from Solly or Moores, make his debut. How do you think he did? Yeah, 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 he did really well. He came into the team, obviously he's still learning to know and adapt to how we play. Um, he's still learning about the, 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 the runs the strikers make and and who comes to get, get on the ball. So overall, it was a very, very a uh, positive display from, from Ethan. He uh, put the ball in the channels when, when required. Um, defensively, he was very, very sound and uh, he was a great addition to the squad. Yeah, and we also saw Callum Gittins go off in the first half. Firstly, how's his injury? Yeah, that was, um, obviously, I think everyone everyone knows. King is suspended and obviously, uh, Proz is, is, is struggling. Um, so we had to bring Alex on centre mid and fair play to Alex. Um, he did one for the he did one for the lads today. He was outstanding when he came on centre mid, um, foreign position for him, but he was he was brilliant. And uh, Gitto got kicked on his ankle and um, struggling with that to be totally honest with you. And uh, hopefully he'll be in contention for Saturday. Yeah, how do you think Wally's sort of presence affected that midfield, especially going into that hectic second half? Yeah, like. Alex's his main objective was to be physical and take one, two touches and get the ball out wide. And um, I thought he broke up play extremely well, especially in the second half. And he was able to just simplify his game. And uh, he caused he caused issues. He used his physicality and um, he did a great job for the lads today. Yeah, and then obviously in the second half, there was two red cards. How do you think that sort of changed the game? Changed the game massively. <laughs> in a negative impact from us. Um, I thought when they had 11 and went down to 10, uh, we were dominating the game. We, we got in some great areas. Um, but then when we went down to nine men, I think something must have clicked in our mindset to think we've won this game already and there was still 25 minutes to go. So it wasn't a spectacle, like I said, and uh, it was just a hard fought, hard fought three points. And um, I'm not, I won't be, I won't be watching that one back. And that's, uh, um, we we'll, we'll move on to Saturday. Yeah, and then looking ahead to Saturday, we welcome Lyston to Amblecote. What are your thoughts going into that game? It'll be a very, very tough game. They've uh, they've had a, a negative result this evening at Redditch, um, so they'll be coming to us um, all guns blazing. Um, they won't want to have two defeats on the bounce, so we have to be we have to be at it, and um, we'll have a few new injuries concerns that will be back in in contention. Um, we'll have Kingy back in, in into the squad. Um, so hopefully we'll we'll have a bit more more strength in depth to to go to um, to have Leeston here and hopefully uh, put in performance to get three points. That's brilliant. Thanks for your time, Neil. Cheers. Thank you.